Capricorn welcome to my channel my name is Sally and this is going to be your love reading for the next 10 days this is going to be a collective energy from all those born under the zodiac sign of Capricorn Sun Moon rising only take what applies to your situation and leave the rest for others if you are new here welcome if you are a returning subscriber welcome so Capricorn let's begin with your reading let's pull one message from Spirit Oracle for you um, in regards to your love life for the next 10 days Holy Spirit, Spirit of Truth, Spirit of Light, Spirit of Wisdom, I welcome you here. Capricorn love reading for the next 10 days. One message for them, please, Holy Spirit, for Capricorn. One message for Capricorn, they are love reading for the next 10 days. What message do you have for them in regards to their love life for the next 10 days, Holy Spirit? Capricorn. One message for Capricorn in regards to their love life for the next 10 days, Holy Spirit. Let's see what's here for you, Capricorn. Holy Spirit for Capricorn, their love life for the next 10 days. What do they need um, to know? What should they be aware of? What message do you have for them in regards? Okay. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah. We have a message from afar. Okay, two came out. We have a message from afar. And we have patience. Okay, let's um, read the message behind each of this card. Um, this says, um, message coming from afar. Expect positive and refreshing news. A great outcome for all. Okay, let's see this one. It says patience. Let's see the message behind patience. It says you are entering a time of great love and peace. Be patient and allow the current storm to clear. Resurrection, no more wounds. Only love predicted in the future. Okay. Let's see what's in your tarot, Capricorn. Holy Spirit for Capricorn. They are love reading for the next 10 days. Capricorn, they are love reading for the next 10 days. Holy Spirit. For Capricorn, they are love reading for the next 10 days. What's in store for them? For Capricorn. They are love reading for the next 10 days. Capricorn. For Capricorn. Okay, let's see. Capricorn love reading for the next 10 days, Holy Spirit. Okay. Alright, Capricorn, let's see. At the top of your deck, we have the Nine of Swords. So, Capricorn, I feel like um, there is someone in your environment that is worried about you, that is worried about this situation with the both of you. This person could possibly be having a sleepless night. A sleepless night. Um, this could be your energy, Capricorn. You could be worried about a situation in your love life here. Your mind is not set to in regards to this particular um, love situation here. This could be your energy or the energy of the person that you are connecting to. Okay, let's see what's in the rest of the card. We have the Two of Pentacles. We have the Wheel of Fortune. Capricorn, you're going back and forth about something here. There is something that is on your mind that is bothering you. And you're going back and forth with it. I see a change here that you are struggling with. You're struggling with change here, Capricorn. Something is changing and you're struggling with that. We have the Ace of Swords. I feel like some of you are beginning to see a situation clearly. You're beginning to see someone for who they truly are. And I feel like you're having a hard time accepting the fact that this is who this person is. Mm -hmm. or you're having a hard time accepting the truth in regards to a particular um situation capricorn okay we have the hierophant we have the ten of pentacles okay we have the justice capricorn i see an offer that will be made to you here for some of you in the next 10 days i see some of you here having a hard time accepting this offer this could be an offer of a relationship or this could be an offer of marriage I see you struggling with this offer. Someone here wants to marry you here. Someone wants to be committed to you. We have the Hierophant, the Ten of Cups, and the Justice card. Yes, someone here that wants to marry you. Someone wants to be with you. But I see that some of you are having a hard time opening up to this person or accepting what it is this person has to offer here to you. Mm -hmm, yeah. There's a new beginning coming that you're struggling with, Capricorn. You're struggling with this new beginning here. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. We have the eight of pentacles, the fool. The ace of pentacles. 
and the seven of pentacles i see something that is happening for you i feel like this is going to bring about a new beginning of abundance towards your way you finally getting what you deserve for some of you you feel like this is too good to be true why for some of you you're still struggling with um something that's happened in your past i feel like you're still struggling with that energies and that is stopping you from opening up to something new here let's clarify to get more insight holy spirit why is the two of pentacles here for capricorn sorry i wanted to say tarot some of you could be dealing with the tarot why is the two of pentacles here for Capricorn, they are love reading for the next 10 days. Let's see. Why is the two of pentacles here? Okay. Yeah, you're going back and forth about something here. I see a love offer that will be made to you here. Someone here is in love with you. Someone here is going to make their love offer to you. But I see you not being in a hurry to accept this offer here. Mm -hmm. You're indecisive about this person and what they are offering you. Why is the wheel of fortune here for Capricorn? You're struggling with change, Capricorn. We have the Empress here. Hmm. Capricorn, I feel like you need to let go of year of the unknown and accept this that is being offered to you. Mm -hmm. Because I see this is a time of abundance for you. But if you are in that um, energy where you're going back and forth, you might miss this. Why is the Ace of Swords here for Capricorn? Holy Spirit. Then I spend this. We have the Ace of Cups. Opportunity for a new beginning for you guys here, Capricorn. Mm, the Three of Wands. I see that some of you could be waiting on someone from your past to come back. That is why you're not open to accepting this new offer here. You're still into someone from your past. You're still holding on to this person. And you're still ready to fight for this relationship uh, with this person. That is why you're not accepting this new beginning here. You're waiting for reconciliation. We have the judgment here. You're, you're waiting for reconciliation with someone from your past. That is why you're not open to this um, new beginning. Why is the Hierophant here? We have the Seven of Sword here. Okay. Why is the Seven of Sword here? We have the Five of Pentacles. Okay, Capricorn, some of you are waiting for someone that is already committed to someone else here. This person did not treat you right. This person lied to you. They played with your feelings and they deceive you. This person left you out in the cold. I see that you're still waiting for this person. For some reason, you still feel something for this person. And you still want to continue this relationship with this person. But I see an offer of a new beginning that is being made to you here that you are not thinking because you are waiting for someone from your past. Why is the Ten of Cups here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? Why is the Ten of Cups here for Capricorn? We have the four of one. Someone here wants to marry you. They want to be with you. Someone could be asking you to move in with them. Some of you could um, be getting that uh, proposal. Like, I want to marry you. I want to be with you. I want the both of us to have a family together. But you, you don't, you, it's not like you don't want this. You're not open to this because you're still attached to past person. Why is the justice here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? We have the three of pentacles here. Yeah. An offer to work on something stable here. But you are not taking this, Capricorn. You're not. I see that some of you are heavily thinking about it. But you're going back and forth with making your decision. Like you're dragging your feet back. Mm -hmm. Why is the word here for Capricorn? We have the nine of wands. Exactly. You're stopping yourself from a new beginning, Capricorn. You're stopping yourself... From a new beginning here because you're still waiting for this man to come back you're still waiting for this woman to come back into your life mm. why is the eight of um, pentacles here for capricorn holy spirit why is the eight of pentacles here for capricorn we have the king of pentacles yeah an offer to work on the relationship here i see new beginning for you guys why is the fool here capricorn you need to let go of the past and focused on this new opportunity that is here for you. You have to. Why is the fool here? We have uh, the ten of wands here. Capricorn, let's go of fear. Let's go of fear of the unknown here and open your heart to this love. Why is the ace of pentacles here for Capricorn? Why is the ace of pentacles here? We have the devil. And the sun. Mm. What a weird energy. I see. We have the eight of cups. 
Hmm. You're stopping yourself from happiness. You're stopping yourself from new beginning. Capricorn, you are. You're deciding to stay stuck um, in where you are. You're deciding to um, stay in the past. Some of you, uh, you feel like you're moving on, but energetically, you're still tied to past person. Mm -hmm. It seems to you like you're moving on here, but in reality, you are still kind of looking back at the past here. So I see a new opportunity here for you. So it's left for you if you want to take it, if you want to um, not take it here. Because I see you still heavily looking back and hoping for someone from your past to come back in while there is a new opportunity that is presenting itself to you, an opportunity to build the kind of relationship that you want. Mm -hmm. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? We have the High Priestess. Capricorn, you need to allow your intuition to guide you. Because some of you, I feel here like your mind is asking you to take this over and forget about someone from your past. But you're choosing not to listen. You're choosing not to listen here, Capricorn. Hmm. You're still heavily in love with this person. You're still in love with someone from your past, Capricorn. Yeah. You're still in love with someone from your past. You are. Okay, for the signs that you might be connecting to here, we have Fire Sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. All signs are here. So Capricorn, this is all I have for you. If you like this type of reading, do not forget to like, do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to leave a comment to let me know how you feel about this reading. And if you do want to book a personal reading with me as a general reading, information to do that will be in the description box. Thank you guys for your love and support. I will see you in my next video. Bye.